didn't get anything out of it. So did you just feel a lot of congestion around the ball and you couldn't break the game the way you wanted it? Oh, look, I thought we were really good with our contested possession tonight. It was a real focused pre-match and, and we did a good job on that. What what we weren't particularly good at tonight was our decision-making under pressure, under the pressure that they brought. So um, it's a credit to Brisbane. They'd done their homework on us uh, and they brought a terrific pressure game tonight that we just couldn't match. Uh, I think we ended up having 27 ineffective handballs uh, for a team that doesn't normally really handball. Uh, so that that's going to hurt you uh, under the pump. So where do you think this leaves you now in the sense that, OK, there's one bubble that's burst, yeah. but where do you, what have you told the girls about yeah, we'll look, we'll, next two games? Well, we've just got to recover really well. We're going to re we'll review the game and we'll be really critical of ourselves, but it's our first loss. Um, we've played four really great games of footy. We played a fifth, pretty good one tonight, um, and Brisbane just were three points better. Um, so... We're going to Darwin and we had a terrific crowd here tonight. The Adelaide supporters were unbelievable. We think the same thing will happen up in Darwin next week. And we've got a, you know, a loss isn't a loss um, if you learn from it. <laughs> and, and I expect that we will very quickly. Who did you want to use Chelsea Randall today? Uh, we wanted to start Chelsea uh, in defence. Um, and that was obviously where she spent the majority of the game. Um, and she really had a great game back there. Uh, you know, would, would she have had more of an impact on the ball? There's probably no point in thinking of what ifs, but um, she was very serviceable down back. Erin had another terrific game in the middle, so did Ebony Marinov had 14 tackles. I mean, that's as well as having, you know, disposals herself. So that's, that's terrific work from our on-ball division. Um, it was just the decision-making under pressure. But what was your thinking of why you wanted to put Chelsea back there? Well, Chelsea's played back. Uh, I think if you go back and look at the games, she's played back uh, a large percentage of the games. She, you know, normally at least half a game she'll play at centre-half back. Uh, Taylor Harris is a, t a formidable forward. Uh, and you could see a couple of times that she looked really dangerous. Um, and Chelsea came on to the ball, I think, uh, towards the end of the third quarter. Incredibly one-on-one game. Mm. A couple of times you both had spares in defence, but is there a reason why you stick so much, or this game sticks so much to one-on-one? -on -one? Well, we really back our our uh, intent to beat our opponent uh, and our pressure acts. Uh, that's how we've kept our, our game plan flowing. Um, but tonight, when we won the football, when we, we unfortunately made poor decisions with it. I guess that old saying that you learn more from your... You lost. Absolutely. Yeah. Absolutely. Um, and I don't think it is a loss if you learn something from it. So uh, that's really important. That's what we've just said to the group. Um, and we don't have time to dwell on it. Each game has been treated like a final. Uh, tonight, the f it was a finals-like atmosphere. There's no doubt about it. Um, it the ball was, it was really hot out there. And uh, it'll be hot again uh, next week against Melbourne. Talk about wide noise. Do you feel that? doesn't it, in terms of also then puts extra pressure on their shoulders and does that uh, have no. a tribute to what happened to them? No, look, I, I don't think so. I actually don't think um, the players were thinking any further than tonight. They wanted to come and bring their best game. Um, I couldn't fault the effort that they brought. Um, that was, you know, you could see that they wanted to, to win it. They were trying to break the lines. Um, and it was just under pressure. We were just too flumbly or, or just made a handball instead of a kick. Injuries. Oh, look, there's a bit of ice, but preventative ice. Um, you know, a few big hits. I think. I think. You know, Brisbane will be sore and will be sore, but nothing, nothing significant. And we should be healthy and available to select from a full list next so week. Toughest game physically you played. Definitely. Well, they came out here, didn't they? Hundred percent. Yeah. 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 What did you learn about again their character? That oh, sort of that was terrific character. I mean, they could have rolled over really easily. You, you saw how. Um, how Perkins reacted when she kicked a goal tonight. Um, you know, that was a real passion of the group, that team spirit that we want to see. She's a part of our family and, and uh, you know, vice versa. So the girls just really dug in and, and kept, kept going right to the end.